Now, once you've installed your brand new Tron Link wallet, it should appear on your browser at the top here. If you don't see it here, then you'll see this icon that looks like a jigsaw puzzle. And when you hover your mouse, it says extension. If you click on that, that will open up this window. What you want to do is look for Tron Link, and then if you put the pin so it goes blue. So you see when I put the pin on, it comes on the browser. And when I take it off, it removes it. So you want to make sure that it's uh, pinned to the browser at the top there. So now that you have it there, you're going to need to activate the Tron Link account because it's a brand new wallet. So when you click on there, you'll get a pop-up similar to this. Now, my one has already been activated, so it doesn't have the activation message. But if you have a brand new wallet, when you click on it, you'll see that it's got some uh, a warning sign there and some red writing. And that red writing says, the account is not active. Please transfer some TRX, which is Tron, to activate the account. So what you'll need to do is to copy that Tron address and then send some Tron from another wallet or an exchange. Now, when you send it, you're actually not going to receive the full amount because it's going to take off a 0.1 fee from you to activate the wallet. So you'll see in this message here um, that if I'm sending a Tron to a, a wallet that's not been activated, Tron Link are going to charge me this 0.1. So just to recap, when you open your, a brand new Tron Link wallet, you're going to need to activate it. To activate it, you need to copy the Tron Link wallet address, which can be found right at the top here. You just click on that button there. That's copied it to your clipboard. And then you can go to wherever you want to send the Tron from. You can send as little as one Tron to activate the wallet. And that's how easy it is to activate your brand new Tron wallet.